Hey team, happy Tuesday. Today we have Romans. Okay, so I know that a lot of you all have done Romans before, so nothing new. Um, so for Romans, you do have nine stations. We do have three pods today. Um, what we're looking at is two sets at each station, two laps per pod. Uh, the work time and the rest time stays the same for each uh, set. We have 35 seconds of work, 25 seconds of rest. So plenty of time to rest in between those sets, plenty of time to pick up a little bit heavier weight as we go through and do them. Okay. Um, for today, we have the wonderful Melissa and who's over there? James? Look at them. So they will be um, our awesome exercise people today. They'll be doing the work workout with you, exercise people. So for station number one, okay? So station number one, we are gonna be doing the Revo double single leg deadlift. So one leg coming down, all right? Staying stable on that one leg, all that weight. Okay, you really have to focus on your balance as you do so. If you can't go all the way down, that's fine. Do what you can. All right, and for that next set, you'll switch legs. All right, since there's two. Next, we have that dumbbell bench incline chest press. Okay, so um, we have James doing what we would do in the studio. Mel, of course, doing what you all would do at home. Using that backpack behind her shoulders, pressing those um, laundry detergent jugs straight up. Perfect. Station number three, we have that dumbbell squat with a pause. Okay, so keeping whatever weight you have at your side, squatting down, pressing those knees out. When you go to the bottom, you are going to pause and then come straight up. Okay, awesome. So for number four, we have kettlebell box bent over arc row. Okay, so this is a little bit different. We do a lot of these bent over rows every day in um, the studio, but you're bringing it back to your hip. So it's almost like you're rounding it back, touching that hip and back down. Sweet. Five, we have weighted lateral lunge. Okay, so choosing whatever weight you have at home, med ball, backpack, lunging it out to the side. Nice. Six, we have slides with the archer push-up. So going down to that push-up, reaching that arm to the side. Okay, if you don't have slides at home, that's totally fine. You just reach your arm to the side and then push back up. You can always drop down to your knees if you need to. Seven, we have dumbbell reverse lunge, diagonal hammer, hammer curl. Okay, so something a little bit different again today. We're gonna drop down to that lunge, bring in that weight across to that opposite shoulder. Nice. For eight, we have barbell row with a mixed grip. So we're gonna hinge at the hips with a slight bend in those knees, bring in that weight to that rib cage and back down, mixed grip. So one overhand, one underhand. Nice. So nine, we have plate hip thrusters. So grabbing any weight we have at home, going straight into those hip thrusters, putting that weight on those heels, push those hips to the sky. Nice. All right, friends. You feel ready to go? All right, friends, we're gonna get warmed up here and get ready for Tuesday's Romans workout. So get that weight ready. There you go, Sissy. Turn it up a little bit, please. All right, get ready to go. We got high knees with butt kicks. Let's go. And look at our perfect matching twins. How cute. So cute. A little dance moves with it. All right, hip swings. Let's go. What do you say on this, James? Bringing around town. It's like a SpongeBob reference. Deep squats with that rotation. 
Dropping it down low. Coming up, rotating each side. Coming down, we got side to side. Hands on those floors, stretching it out, nice. Yes. All right, down to the ground, we got 10 mountain climbers to three push-ups. Warming up those muscles, getting ready for this awesome workout. All right, friends, roll it over on that back. Stretch out that lumbar part of your spine. This is my favorite warm-up stretch. Oh my gosh. We're doing the foot challenge. All right, hip thrust. Get it ready. This is one of our exercises for today. So get those glutes fired, get them warmed up. All right, roll back, split those legs, reach out, hook and row. Here we go, up on those feet, fast feet. Yes, I love it. Melissa, James, it's almost like they're twerking. They're trying to be like me. Oh my gosh. Here we go, just squat. Looking good, this is part of the workout team. Let's go, get it up, jump high. Warm that body up, cause it is cold in here today. All right friends, here we go. Deciding on what weight to use for that Revo double single leg deadlift. Okay, so we're gonna get started in 10 seconds. Grab the weight of your choice and get ready. So choose which leg you wanna start with. Doesn't matter, left or right. Here we go. Let's go, 35 seconds of work. So staying on that one leg, putting all that weight into that foot, press down into it, keep that balance, okay? Really think about slow and controlled. Do not let that weight weigh you down. Slow and controlled. Keep those shoulders back. Keep that neck in line. You got five seconds here, team. Three, two, one. All right, so we're gonna switch legs. We're gonna switch legs for this second set. Okay, so if you did left, you're gonna do right. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Nice. It is hard to switch it. They're really focused on putting all that weight in that foot. It's okay if you stumble. It's okay if you get off balance. Slow and control. You got 10 seconds, team. Here we go. In three, two, one, set it. All right, guys. We're moving to station number two now. So we're doing that dumbbell bench incline chest press. So choosing what you want behind those shoulders to make it an incline. Okay, so choosing, Melissa's gonna use the backpack and then choosing your weight. So she's using her laundry detergent. Here we go. Three, two, one. Nice. Dropping those weights out to your side. Letting those elbows come about shoulder width apart. Nice. And pressing it straight back up. Really working those chest muscles. You got 10 seconds, team. Looking good. Here we go in three, two, one, set it. So you got plenty of time to rest. If you need something a little bit heavier, you can choose something a little bit heavier. Plenty 
a time to rest here. You got 10 seconds and then we're gonna do this exercise again. I like it. Here we go team, 35 seconds of work. Dropping it down. Nice. Making sure that whatever you're using for your incline at home, that your neck and your head is rested on it. You got 15 seconds, team. You got this. Looking strong today. Nice, James. Keeping it going. We got five. Here we go in three, two, one. Nice. Okay, so we're going to the last exercise in this pod. So we got uh, station three, the dumbbell squat with a pause. So one 1,000, two 1,000 is gonna be the pause at the bottom. So choose what weight you would like. All right, here we go in three, two, one. So that um, whatever weight you have is gonna be right outside those knees as you drop down. So going down into it, one 1,000, two 1,000, and then coming straight up. Got it, guys. Make sure you're breathing in and out. Also, bring that weight on the inside of those knees, like James is, and coming straight up. Sometimes it's a little awkward depending on whatever weight you're using. Three, two, one. So, I liked how James did go inside of the knees because there is sometimes when you use certain weights that it is awkward that it is on the outside of your knees. So if you need to, bring it in the middle. I mean, they're just dancing. Always dancing. Here we go. Three, two, one. Control it. Make sure you're pressing those knees out as you go down. I like it. Nice deep squat there, Mel. Looking good, sis. All right, guys. We got 10 seconds here. Let's go. Stay strong. Keep working. Three, two, one. All right. So we are going all the way back to station number one. Station number one. Hey, hey. Look at her. All right, so the Revo double single leg deadlift is what we are going back to. So we're going through this pod one more time and then taking a water break and moving to pod number two. Here we go, let's finish it out. Staying on that one leg. Slow and controlled. Do not let that weight on you, okay? Keeping those shoulders back. Keeping everything in line. So as you go down, your eyes should go down to the floor as well. Find that spot on the floor, focus on it. Here we go in three, two, one. All right, we're gonna switch legs here. How we doing, team? Good? Hey, oh, woo, hamstrings. I think that means that that hurts. Hey. All right, so this is your last time with this exercise today. So make it count, let's go. You got 35 seconds. Nice. I love it guys. Way to stay balanced, way to stay in control. They have control over those weights. The weights do not have control over them. Everything is staying in line. They are pressing through that foot. You got seven seconds, team. Let's go. Yep. And set it. All right, going back to station number two. Station number two, we got that dumbbell bench incline chest press.
Here we go. And go. Nice, guys. Dropping those elbows down to the shoulders and pressing straight up. Looking super strong here, team. Keep working. Keep breathing, guys. Keep breathing in and out. Here we go in three, two, one. Nice. Set it up. Take your breath. But if you're Melissa, you don't take any rest. You just keep working. Always. Just getting a little extra in today. Working that core. All right, guys. In four seconds, we're going to do this last time of chest press. Let's go. Nice. Keep breathing, team. Don't hold that breath. Let me hear it. Nice. Yes. Get 12 seconds. Keep breathing. You got it. Here we go, team. Three, two, one. Set it. All right. So, last exercise of this pod. We have dumbbell squats with that pause, pause at the bottom. Okay, so we get two sets here and then we'll have that water break and we will move to pod number two. You guys are killing it, looking strong. All right, here we go. Grab those weights in three, two, one. Nice. So I like that they turn to the side so we can see how they keep everything in line. Dropping it down. Got James with the weight in between the knees and Mel with the weight on the outside of the knees. Again, either way. 10 seconds, team. Three, two, one, set it. always talking. No one wants to talk to me or hang out with me. They just talk to each other. It's fine. Here we go. In three, two, one. This is your last set in this pod with this exercise. Make it count. Let's go. You do what you need to do at home to make this exercise, make this workout hard for you. You best slow it down down there. You got eight seconds. Let's go. Look how strong they look. Three, two, one. Nice. You got one minute to grab water, rest it up, dance it out, whatever you feel like doing. I'm glad you didn't fall this time. <laughs> I came with them. All right, team. So a glimpse into pod number two. Pod number two, we have those kettlebell box bent over arc rows. So they're a little bit different with the normal rows we do. Five, we have the sandbag or weighted lateral lunge. James with the water. And then six, we have those slides, archer push-ups. Okay, those are our three exercises. We are going to start with the kettlebell box spin over arc row. Okay, so finding something. Yeah, hand on the side of your couch, whatever you need. We got five seconds. Grab that weight, let's go. And go. Come on, 35 seconds of work. All right, so looking at James, looking at Melissa. See how they bring that weight back to their hip. Okay, so we're not rolling it straight up to where we punch our elbows straight back, but we're bringing it around. Working more of that lat instead of 
of that muscle right behind the shoulder. You got 10 seconds, team. 10 seconds. Let's go. Burn it out. Here we go in three, two, one. I love it. Uh, should have had that leg back. Okay, so um, James says bring the leg back that you're on the same side as you're doing. So now Melissa's gonna be on the right side, so her right leg is gonna be back. Here we go in three, two, one. Looks good. There we go. Nice. Really see those muscles working. I love it. So if you notice how she has everything tightened up, she has her core tight, she has her shoulders tight, she's stable on that box, bringing that weight back. Five seconds, guys, let's go. Three, two, one, set it. All right, friends, we're going into station number five. We had that weighted lateral lunge, weighted lateral lunge. So grab those weights and get ready. Three, two, one. Dropping it down, side to side. Yeah. So you're gonna stay on that same side the entire set. Putting that weight in that leg, you're dropping out to pushing off that foot to bring you back to center. Okay, we're not letting that weight in front of us weigh us down to the front. We're keeping a proud chest, shoulders back. Here we go in three, two, one. Nice. Okay, so we're gonna switch sides here. That's fine. That's fine. Looking good, team. How we feeling? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Opposite side now. Yes. Then he pushes off that foot, comes back to center. I love it, guys. They have a nice rhythm going here. Constant pace. They're breathing in and out, controlling that breath. You got five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, guys. So Melissa loves this exercise. We are doing the slide. Archer push up. She likes it. James does not. So if you don't have slides at home, Melissa is going to show you that you can just reach that hand out. We are going in three, two, one. Let's go. Pushing it up. Arm goes out. When you drop it down into that push up position, reach that arm out. Nice. So Melissa has a wide stance to help stabilize. Just keeping that core tight. That butt is not shot up in the air. It's also not uh, pressing her hips to the ground. She has everything in line. Good. And set it. Nice, stretch out that back. Yeah, that one's rough. That one's rough. Um, <laughs> Melissa has been around me too, too much. I'm a bad influence. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh God. So Melissa dropped down to her knees, which is totally fine. As we get tired, we do not want to compromise our form. So if you need to go down to those knees, that's totally fine. 
doing the same movement. James is killing it over here with the slide. You got eight seconds, let's go. You got this guys, looking good. Super strong and set it. All right, guess what? You completed lap number one for pod two. So that means we go all the way back to number four. Okay, so we're going to Kettlebell, Box, Spin Over, Arc Road. Here we go in three, two, one, let's go. Nice. I love this one, can you? Oh, definitely harder after the push-ups. You can see the muscles working both in James and Melissa's shoulders as they bring it back, their triceps. 10 seconds, guys. Stay with it. Looking strong, team. Three, two, one, set it. Y'all are nasty. They're all sweaty and gross. Gorgeous. I mean, gorgeous. So pretty. Oh my God. Here we go. Other side. I'm so sorry for you all at home. This is why we make her stay on the other side of the camera so much. So if you if you hear her coaching, um, this is the reason why. Because when we put her in front of the camera, she acts like that. But that's why we love her. You got 13 seconds, guys. 13 seconds. Keep burning it out. Nice. Nice, James. Keep going. Three, two, one. One, you are done with that exercise today. That's it. All right, friends. We got that weighted lateral lunge. Weighted lateral lunge. So James is gonna use the dead ball. Mel is gonna use her backpack. Yeah, yeah. Got this, guys. Here we go. Looking good, team. Don't let that weight pull you over. Stay tall. Nice. Dropping that weight into that foot and then pushing off that foot to bring you back to standing. Woo! You got 10 seconds. Let's go. Three, two, one, woo! Don't fall, don't fall. Toes pointed forward. Are you struggling with that? Oh, okay, yeah. So Mel made a good point. Make sure that both feet are pointed straight, toes pointed forward as you step out. Don't let it come out to the side, okay? Here we go, last set. Let's go. Yep. Nice, guys. Keeping everything face forward in line. You got 15 seconds. Look. This bag is heavy. You got five seconds, guys. Let's go. Three, two, one, set it. All right, this is our last station, last exercise for pod number two. Paper towel. Use paper towels on kitchen floors to do this one, or you can just reach your arm out, whatever one works. So here we go. Nice, there it is. I like the wide stance, keeping them stable. Dropping down low, look how low they get. They're not laying on the ground. They're hovering over that ground. 
holding themselves up with that one arm and reaching the other one out and back in. Nice. Keep that core tight. Five seconds, guys. Yes, you can. Find a way. And set it. Nice. You got one more set at this station, guys. Okay, so 35 seconds of work. I know those shoulders are tired. I know those arms are tired, but you got this. Yes, you can. Okay. We are almost through pod number two. All right, finish strong. You got a water break after this, so earn that water break in three, two, one. Let's go. Nice. Okay, so Mel has dropped down to those knees. She doesn't want to compromise her form. Okay, she knows that she's gotten tired. Those shoulders are burning. She's still doing a great job getting a great workout in. Good job, team. You got this 15 seconds. Push, do not let up. This is not the time to quit. We do not quit. You got five seconds. Give me, give me one more. And set it. Good job, team. You got one minute. One minute to grab that water, take that breath, shake out those arms. Okay. All right, friends, we are going into oh gosh before i even start talking just let him have his moment just let him have it i guess i'll you're welcome okay anyways now we got that out of the way uh we have three stations left in this pod we have that dumbbell revolt lunge and diagonal hammer curl for seven for eight, we have the barbell row with the mixed grip. And for nine, to finish it off, we have that plate hip thruster. So right now, I need you to grab stuff for a dumbbell revo lunge with the di diagonal hammer curl. Okay, here we go in three, two, one, let's go. Dropping it down into that lunge and bringing that weight across your chest. Nice. Keeping everything forward, everything in line. Still keeping those shoulders over the hips. Pulling those shoulders back. Yep. Bringing that opposite weight to opposite shoulder. Looking good, team. You got 10 seconds. Staying stable. Three, two, one. Set it. Job. Inside of the biceps. Mel said they're inside of the biceps are killing after doing that. Or James. Alright, friends, here we go. Second set. Three, two, one, let's go. It's fine. Can't be perfect all the time. Huh. Stay in balance. You got this, guys. Eight seconds. Three, two, one. Set it. All right, friends. Here we go. Barbell row mix grip. So if you need to put together your barbell, as Melissa is. Go ahead and do so. Mel. All right, friends, five seconds. Grab that weight. Three, two, one. We got that mixed grip. Okay, so one overhand, one underhand. All right, so we got those bend in those knees, pressing those hips back, flat back. Breaking that weight to that rib cage and back down. I like it. Keeping those weights in the heels. Pressing it back. Nice, guys. You got eight seconds. Here we go in three, two, one. Nice. How we doing, team? Sucks. Hurting. 
James, what is, what are we doing? Kings, <laughs> that's exactly what I was thinking. Oh my gosh, here we go. Yep, I was wondering, I couldn't think of what it was called, but yep. Yep, Egyptian. That's what James looks like right now. He literally looks like that. King James, Jesus. That's all we need. Got it, guys. Keep working here. Keep working. Pulling that weight. Keep breathing. Five seconds, guys. In and out, in and out. Here we go in three, two, one. Set it. Always dancing, always moving, keeping it funny. That's cute. What is that? <laughs> All right, guys, we got that hip thrust. Find that weight, place it on those thighs, those hips, and press it up. Perfect. Let's go. Come on. Keeping that weight in the heels. Yep. Press those hips to the sky. Using any type of weight you may have at home. Maybe having your child sit on your hips. Press them to the sky. You got five seconds. Three, two, one. Mel said she's tired. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what this quarantine is doing to people. It's having the same effect on them. Here we go in three, two, one. You got it, guys. Squeeze those glutes as you press those hips to the sky. Keep that core tight. Nice. Really squeeze it. You got it, guys. We got 10 seconds. Three, two, one. All right, friends. We are going back to the beginning of this pod to dumbbell reverse lunge with that diagonal hammer curl. Okay, so we're gonna do all of that all over again to finish out this workout. So grab that weight and we're going in three, two, one. Drop back into that lunge, bring that weight across your chest, tap in that other shoulder. Nice, guys. Control it. You got 10 seconds, team. Looking good. Stay with it. Three, two, one. Your last set with this exercise. Last set with your exercise. Look gorgeous. Uh, here we go. You got it, guys. Stay on balance. Keep it going. Keep working. Make sure we're breathing in and out. Keep that breath. Yes, there we go. Nice. See how Mel's hips are right over that knee? Her hips are right under those shoulders. Everything is in line perfect. You got five seconds, team. Three, two, one. Yes. Yep. Yep. You have two. Praise be. You got two exercises to go. Uh, apparently Mel thinks she is a kung fu fighter ninja. We got barbell row mixed 
grip. Set up your barbell, mix that grip up, and let's go. In three, two, one, we're going. Nice. Find that spot on the floor, focus on it, keeping everything in line. that flat back don't round those shoulders making sure those shoulders are pulled back in line with those hips sometimes the weight make you round those shoulders down make sure you have control over it and set it <laughs> Melissa's very very sweaty Oh my gosh, I can't. Here we go in three, two, one. Let's go. Nice. You know, we gotta have a little bit of fun every once in a while. Huh? I'm always coaching. Looking good, team. Stay with it here. Last time with this exercise, make it count. Let's go, burn it out here. Last time using your arms today. Here we go in three, two, one. Woo! One more station. All right guys, we got one more station here. We're gonna go into this hip thrust. Oh, is that Melissa grabbing the two laundry detergents? She's not clean. Here we go in three, two, one. Make it challenging, guys. Use things around the house. Make it hard, just like you would if you were here. Pressing through those heels of your feet, squeezing those glutes, keeping those abs tight, breathing in and out. 15 seconds, let's go. got this guys, you got this. Stay with it. Three, two, one. Last break, last set. You have 35 seconds of work left and that is it for today, okay? Like I always say, we're gonna finish stronger than we started. Do what you need to do right now to make it challenging. We're going in three, two, one. Let's go, finish it out. Yes, you can, find a way. This is your time. Make it worth it, team. Looking good. 15 seconds and we are home got this all the way through all the way through three two one you have completed Roman nice job team you are done for today